I wasn't planning on making this video, but I'm going to make it anyways. I mean, this was the biggest disgrace I've ever seen from the San Francisco 49ers this whole season and the past couple of years. What kind of performance was that against the Chicago Bears? Wow, they just made the Bears look like the number one team in the NFL. It was just awful. Chip Kelly, I don't know what happened to your team. 1-11. 1-11. Just remind yourself, they won the first game, then proceeded to lose the next 11 games. How does that happen? I don't know. But Jim Tom Sula, at least he finished the season 5-11. I don't even think we're going to win the next four games and we're going to be ending up going 1-15. Yes, that's how bad we are. 1-15 in my opinion. They might not even win another game, but I'll say that prediction for next week against the New York Jets, but oh, it was just so awful. Colin Kaepernick, that was just the biggest dud I've ever seen in the history of football. How do you only throw for five yards? Yes, only five yards in the NFL game, and then you get benched for Blaine Gabbard, and he throws more yards than you, even though it wasn't great, but he threw 30 yards more than Colin Kaepernick. Brock Osweiler's doing well in Green Bay. I don't know if they won the game or not. I'm not sure. I don't have the scoreboard with me ahead of time, but hey, he threw more yards than you in the snowy weather. I don't care. You shouldn't be using the weather as an excuse. You should throw more than five yards. That was just a disgrace, and this might be the boiling point. He might be out in San Francisco for good, and I heard this morning that he's going to avoid his contract for the 49ers, and be my guest. You can get out of this team. I mean, I, I knew you weren't going to be the future of this team anyway, so good riddance in my opinion. I mean, thanks for what you did for 2012 and 2013, but ever since then, you've regressed, 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 and then this game might have been the boiling point of everyone wanting you out because because I don't know how you only throw for five yards. One out of four passes. The defense for the Chicago Bears looked like the old Chicago Bears defense. Akeem Hicks had a fantastic performance against the 49ers. I mean, everyone in San Francisco, you should all be ashamed of yourselves after this performance, after this debacle. We looked worse than every other game this whole season, in my opinion. We looked worse than the game against New England, against Seattle, all the other games. We looked all right or a little below average, but this one was below, below average. I don't know how, but... Hmm. Just a summary of the 2016 San Francisco 49ers, and I don't know when they blocked the punt against Bears. Dante Johnson stepped out of bounds to the four yard line, but then the whole team started to celebrate that they scored a touchdown, and they didn't score a touchdown. They nullified a damn touchdown, and then they ended up scoring only a field goal. Two field goals. That's it. Wow. <laughs> it was just an awesome game to watch for me. Uh, I had a fun time watching this game, and ooh whatever but just a summary of san francisco season chip kelly i don't know where he's going he might be going back to oregon he keeps denying that he's going back to oregon but we'll see then but if he leaves to go to oregon this is just a slap in the face because we fired two coaches in two seasons that is just how much to blame jed york and trent bucky especially jed york since he made all those hirings and decided to fire jim harbaugh and stuff like that so but i don't want to go over that and colin kaepernick just not being the franchise quarterback for this team but i think everyone knew that coming into the season anyways he wasn't gonna be the franchise quarterback for this team so We'll see if he stays with the 49ers. He voided his contract, but I don't think he's going to stay with his team. And I don't think San Francisco is going to sign him anymore. Then they're going to go into another direction and draft the quarterback this season for the draft. So it was just a disgraceful performance. Don't have anything else to say. And yeah, I'm done. And I'll catch you guys up later when I predict the Jets and 49ers game. Just had to make this video because it was just a disgraceful performance that I've seen this whole season from the 49ers against a bad team, in my opinion, the Chicago Bears. But whatever. So I'll catch you guys up later. You guys have a nice rest of your week, hopefully.